What is going on, YouTube? My name is The Barnes Factor, and welcome to another episode of Bronze Beasts. Today, we put together a new team, and you can already tell, it's the USA. Now, there is one attainable bronze in form for the USA, and I had to try him out. Uh, the rest of the team, there's a lot of good bronze players for the United States. Um, we have Findley at striker, Finlay, the in form at right wing, um... There is Ash, the left back. Jean Baptiste is one of the center backs, and Wynn is that center back with 93 pace. Well, I got his right back card. Um, and the goalkeeper, I can't remember his name this time, but trust me, you will remember his name. Uh, we start off. The first goal from the USA team is actually from the end form, and you uh, you guys don't really see it, but I was really trying to force the ball to this end form. Um, I really, really wanted him to be the star player of this team, but unfortunately he had high, high work rates and he just stood way too far back. Um, here's a really good goal from Fendley, and this is right before halftime I score this goal. And shortly coming up, you'll see that was pretty much it from this game. Just completely done. After, after that goal, this game got really, really boring. I think it was an evenly matched game too. I think I had six shots, six on target. He had seven shots, four on target, if I remember correctly. But oh, how good do those pop school jerseys look, by the way? But there is Lampson, 9.0 from a bronze goalkeeper. He was the best bronze goalkeeper in last year's game, hands down the the best bronze goalkeeper I used this year. He is so 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 good. Um. The next team you'll see me come up against, this one confused me a lot. This guy is playing a striker at right wing, a center back at striker, and a right mid at left wing. And then he's got a whole bunch of jumbled mess in the middle. And it, it did take me a while to crack this guy down because I was really confused. I thought he might have just been trying to like relegate himself or whatever because we are in Division 9 now. But um, after I broke him down, um, I kind of just steamrolled. Here, I think it's the ninth minute. The first clip you see is actually him getting uh, one of his center backs sent off. And uh, that was another thing that kind of threw me off during the game. Because I don't know if you guys have ever played uh, games before where you have uh, an opponent gets one of their players sent off. But the, the momentum kind of just sways their way. Um, unfortunately for this guy, it didn't sway that much. But you see right here, one of wins just, he is so strong. Um, I didn't pick him because of his 93 pace. I picked him because of his 82 physicality. And here Finley is just showing, you know, uh, once I learned to be patient with this team, that's when I started scoring with him. Uh, I just had to slow down the play, just, you know, slow dribble in the box. I kept sprinting, and his goalkeeper kept picking it up. I just kept sprinting. Right, sorry for that cut. Uh, someone rang my doorbell. But uh, anyway, this, this next goal coming up here, um, he just gets a free kick. Uh, right before uh, the midway point and I just he just a bad free kick and I just catch him on the counter fake shot with Finley and just go right on through uh, Finley is amazing um, honestly one of the best strikers I've used this year like overall uh, not just bronze strikers but overall and then that's the last thing that happened before halftime uh, here's the halftime stats you can see I'm completely dominating this guy 8 shots 7 on target to his 2 and 1 here he makes a mistake. Unfortunately, Findley can't quite get to the ball, but I do wrestle it away from him. Uh, pass to Findley and then back to Findley and just squeeze it by his goalkeeper. Uh, that is where the red card did come in handy for me because of that missing center back. Um, and then here in the 90th minute, this is me just trying not to give Findley the ball. I was trying to keep the ball away from him because I wanted to show off the rest of the team. But, um... Here is just me uh, work it to Cronin and then end up passing it uh, into the net through Cronin. Uh, like I said, I was just trying to get a goal that was not from Findley because he was just dominating everything. He was everywhere. I'm telling you guys, he is the best bronze striker. And you see this guy's frustration as he just clears the ball straight from kickoff, trying to make something. Um, but that's pretty much the end of the game. You'll just see I just kicked the ball out from the goal kick and the whistle blows. So uh, I do want to apologize for not uploading video yesterday. Uh, in case you guys didn't know, uh, 
I record a video a day in advance, so if I upload on Monday, I just recorded the video on Sunday, and as most of you know, Sunday was Mother's Day, so I was busy and couldn't really play games that day, uh, so, um, but to make up for it, you are going to get a double upload today, and you are going to get one at noon, which is where I'm posting this now, and you're probably going to get one in about three hours time. Sorry about that, if you heard that, I just got text message. But you're going to get one in about three hours time. So, uh, I hope you guys will enjoy the second episode. Uh, my name is The Barnes Factor. Uh, please leave a like if you liked the video. Uh, if you didn't, please leave a dislike. Let me know in the comments what I can do to improve my videos if you disliked it. But that is all for me, so I will see you guys later.